Howdy y'all, this is Regulus Raiden, and welcome back to our adventures here in Mail Time, where last time we had finished as many of the little side quests that we had, and we were uh, about to dive in and try to finish this final letter um, that we were trying to go get turned into Greg the Bear. That sounds like so much fun. Anyway, um, to that's what we're doing today, and I wanted to make one stop along the way, so I didn't have us meet almost over there. Besides, the journey is half of the half of the adventure, right? So, we're gonna go ahead and head that direction, but the only thing I want to do real quick before we get over there is I kind of wanted to go back on the well and uh, go talk to that thing a little bit one more time in the well. So that sounds like so much fun. Is that a bug? I think that's a bug. Hmm, huh. I almost made that. If I tried, I might would have. Oh, I didn't need to be this high. Oops. Oh well, that's fine. You there, Mr. Will Voice? No. He doesn't want to talk to me. Okay, so I need to go... Let's see, is it there? Ooh, okay. So much fun. I'm gonna walk into that. Okay. Hi. Yeah. Nope, nope, I'm not on it. I think that's enough. Potentially too much. Right. Yay! We made it across. We need to do a lot of gliding, because we still have that quest to glide for however many minutes. Let's check it real quick. 900 seconds. Oh boy. Oh, 
or something over here. Let's see. Let it count lighting time. That'd be funny. Mr. Greg, I have a letter for you. It's kind of important. Wake up! Do you think he's dead, B? Maybe we should poke him with a stick to check. <sighs> okay, okay, I'll poke the bear. What? You think he's gone into hibernation? What's that? Bzz. Oh, like a super nap. That's okay. I want to wait for him to wake up. For how long? <laughs> Bzzz. Until spring? But I can't deliver the letter. But then I can't deliver the letter today. <laughs> Leave it here? Absolutely not. Someone else might take it. It's not the Mail Scout way. <laughs> I don't want to go ask Janet for help. <laughs> Fine, I'll do it. Dan's probably still at the bank. Oh, hello! Okay then. Well, that was interesting. We had an entire conversation with a bee. not dropping that far. I need the minutes. Seconds. Whatever. Alright. So our first conversation with the bee. Very interesting. spot and just glide down. Oh. I thought Janet would be here. She was here when I left. And didn't seem to be intent on moving. Ooh. What's that? You can smell where Janet went? I didn't know bees could smell. A hundred times better than I can. Wow. Alright. Snips away, Detective B. Surprise! Uh, congrats on your first completed assignment! Oh, um, that's so nice of you all. But, um, I'm sorry to disappoint. Okay then. I didn't deliver the letter to Greg. I'm so sorry. Could I have a word, Rex? I'm so sorry, Janet. Please don't be mad. I'm not mad at you. Why not? I failed. I, I can't come back from something like this. All the scouts would think I'm a fraud. Sometimes we're just kind of meant to fail and learn from it, you know. No, I don't know. I need this needed this delivery to go well. Why? What about all the other letters you've delivered by now? Don't think I wasn't keeping an eye on you. Because it was my assignment. I've got to complete my first assignment perfectly. 
What will happen if you fail it? I don't know. Everyone will be disappointed in me. And think I'm not a real male scout. You'll ruin me. Does that mean I'm not a real male scout either? Have you ever failed an assignment? Yep, many times. One time I read the address wrong and it ended up at the North Pole. <laughs> really? Yeah, sometimes you mess up. Or sometimes something just can't be done with the way you wish it would. It's totally fine to fail. It just happens occasionally, and we learn from it. Thanks, Janet. That makes me feel better. No worries, Reckless. Now, how about you go enjoy this party everyone put together for you? Come talk to me again when you're ready to skedaddle. Okay, Mrs. Boss. That is so cute. Aww. Oh, we're in the square. Okay. Can, can I talk to y'all? Okay, hang on. What is, what is, what is, oh my god. I can't talk to her. Oh, even he's over here. Hey, you. Hey, Jim. Seems you made it down from the valley then? Made it down into the valley then? Oh, hey, Regulus. It's fine. The best sets are the one where the crowd walks on stage. And interrupts the artist. Oh, sorry. It's okay, really. I think I need a little reminding that other people exist. It is nice to have an audience for once. Even though some seem more concerned with themselves than the system heavenly music. Truly ingrates. You're right. I'm glad I got to meet you, Regulus. Now I must return to my musical duties. It's really hard to play and talk at the same time. I'm hanging on by a thread here. Oh, okay. Break a leg. I would rather not. See ya. That's... that's cute. Can I speak with her? No, I can't speak with her. Darn. <laughs> They're all having fun. Can I speak with you? There we go. Clarence! Hey, Clarence! I can't hear us. Oh, they're crying out. Clarence! Oh, hey there, little scout. Don't mind me. I was just jamming. Thanks so much for your help right there. You've turned Egbert's frown upside down. Nothing short of a miracle. You know, with the noise complaint and all, I figured you'd be into, I don't know, a cooler instrument? Scout, scout, scout. You are truly not yet wise in the ways of the world. This triangle possesses unique, raw mu musical power. Now I am its vessel to unleash it on the world. You dig? I, I'm digging. I think. Don't worry. When you get back to it, and I'll show you what it's all about. Just listen and enjoy the party. Thanks again, little friend. Triangle? Hi, Socks. Hey, Socks. You good, Socks? Let Socks ask regular regulars their question. Socks look like Socks want to talk. Socks no spare leg to stand on. Bing bong music costs lots leg energy. You don't need legs to chat though. Regular stick skull. Not chat time. Socks chase auditory glory. Wow, that's a long word for you, Socks. Regulars go to jail. Jail? In Socks head. Regulus is for in forever jail. Every day. That's too bad. I'll be off then. I love your xylophone playing though. It sounds beautiful. Think. Oh. So he's supposed to be on a xylophone. Hello. Oh, you. This is your party, isn't it? That's what I'm told. I guess you're not quite- You're quite the big shot around here. Now, huh? I think you're real something. Well, listen here, Bob. This town ain't big enough for two of us. And this kitty's got claws. Before you go on, I just want you to know I'm really quite scared. Quivering, even. I don't like your tone, Regulus. I'll show you. When I finally get my- Shoot, what was it again? Deposit? Yep, 
That was definitely a deposit you signed for. Nothing more. You're sure you delivered it to the right people? I want my stacks now. It went to the right people, all right. Wink. You said wink out loud. Yeah, what about it? But I finally get that deposit, I'm buying out the company you work for. Okay. See you then, future boss. <laughs> yeah, I can see that being a thing. Hello! What you doing there? Ah! I mean... Ah, nice to see you, Redis. What brings you here on this fine morning? I mean, evening. I mean... Is there something on Kiki's forehead? What? No. But you seem to be staring at it pretty intently. Well... For me, coin collecting is just a start. I want many coins. Kiki has many coins. Like, lots. And why spend valuable energy finding out how to go about doing that? When I could just steal someone else's idea? Spoken like a true capitalist. You'll go far in this field. You think? Well... I hope so. But we'll see. Thank you, Rex. I'll make you proud. Don't know if that would be making me proud, but you can go off, I guess. <laughs> Irene? Oh, hi, Rickwood. Oops, I mean, hi, Rickwood. Sorry, it's weird to not be working anymore. No worries. What if I told you that Recruit is my middle name? It is? No, my middle name is Garlic. <laughs> oh my god. Why is your middle name Garlic? Long story. Too long. Too long for now. So what do you think of the party? I love it. It's nice to see everyone out and about having and having fun. I'm glad. When Janet asked for help in organizing the party earlier, I felt right to contribute after all you've done for me in the game. You and Janet set up this party? Thank you so much. I guess I was thinking about what we were talking about earlier. About sipping drinks? You do realize that was a metaphor for wealth redistribution, right? <laughs> yeah, I got that. I was thinking about what it's like to be busy. I like being busy. Sometimes it feels like relaxing is the hard part. The problem starts when I don't get to not be busy. But helping out with event planning like this, the relaxing part is the... The relaxing is part of the being busy. And if it's up to me, We'll have a grubble wood get down every week. No need to worry about the cost. A certain feline friend is fronting the expenses. Well, don't let me keep you from enjoying your first party of many. You should enjoy it also. It's in your honor. Here comes the next party too, right? Wouldn't miss it for the world, Irene. Good, good. Can't wait to see you there. That's so cute. Oh my gosh, you're here too! Hello, Max. And Max's hat. Hi from both of us. This isn't my regular hat though. Oh? It's my party hat. It looks identical to your normal hat. Ah, uh, but it isn't entirely unidentical to my... In every other way. That's why you greeted it just now. On some instinctive level, you knew it was different. You were... You are overestimating my instincts. But this is a party, so I'll agree to keep the peace. Good call. And good party. Enjoy it. I will. <laughs> oh my god. Kaz! Oh, Rickless. How delightful to see you. Are you enjoying this petite... Petite du courier? Oh, the party? It's splendid. Our good feeling friend has done the honors of funding this again. Knowingly? Some questions are best left on the answer desk. I understand. How's the art going? Oh, so so. Inspiration comes and goes. You know how it is. Not really. I don't need much inspiration to, to deliver mail. I suppose not. But there is a cutie in the band over there. Their passion and energy is certainly inspiring me. Who? Who is it? Don't look, don't look. And also, don't ask. I'll never, ever tell. Aww. Chin up, Griffiths. You did great work today. Hope to see you around again soon. Out of Oscar. See you soon, Stinky Crow. I swear, if you call me Stinky one more time. I'm joking, I'm joking. Bye, Cass. Bye, Griffiths.
That is cute. In the band, huh? I think he means, um... Clarence. Any of these people gonna talk to me? Can I talk to Shelby? Yes, I can. Uh-huh. Hi, Regulus. Hi, you Shelves. You finally out of sport mode? Yes. It's in party mode now. Gosh, it wasn't that long ago that you arrived here in Grumblewood Grove. And already you have a party in your honor. Really moving on up, little scout. Aw, oh, gee, thanks. I'll never forget my humble beginnings. You were my very first delivery, Shelby. Did you know that? Huh. Yeah, I knew. You were shaking like a little leaf. You were so nervous. No, I wasn't. That's an embellish... Um, that's an embellish retelling. Embellish or not, you've come far, little scout. And here... And you have better to go ahead of you, if you're willing to go there. You know you can do it if you put your mind into it. Thank you, Shelves. Those are some real kind of words. Okay, you on this way up. You made the trip all by yourself. You'll do good. You'll do good, kid. Now, go on and party. Off I go! Alright. Ham. Why, hello there, Ham. Hello yourself, Ridless. Thanks again for putting me out of... For pulling me out of my culinary slump. What a bad job, Scout. Yeah, yeah, not what I call him. Huh? What's with the face? I'm confused at how you were dancing that hard, but are breathing, breathing really normally. Ah, uh, it's all on the core strength, my dear Scout. My extreme internal muscles are simply not allowed. Well, I need to be out of breath. Determined imitation of normal breathing, I call it. Or D-I-N-B for short. Also, now, no one can tell if I'm nervous when I'm D-I-N-B. Are you nervous, Ham? A little. I'm not so good with people. Do you think I'm dancing too much? Am I making a fool out of myself? Be honest. Nah, you good. You're dancing exactly the right amount, right amount for you. Thanks for this. Glad you think so. Well, I hate to die and dash, but I have to stop talking now. The longer I spend talking, the less time I spend eating. And time is calories, my friend. You gotta replace the energy you use as soon as you use it. Or you're gonna run out. It's called replacing energy real time. Or RIT for speed talking. I am RIT. Eating and dancing? Truly a jack of all trades. More like a ham of all. Of all. Shoot, I can't think of a rhyme again. That's okay. Save all the brain power for the writing and the DIN being. Right you are, right you are. Bye, Riddles. It's nice to meet you. Likewise, Hamalam. Gosh. Hello. I would like to speak with one of you, too. Bomb bomb. How's that treating you? Splendidly. As you can see, I am reclining with my homies. I've got my punch, the sun's out. A rat could not want one more. That's good to hear. Things are winding down after the heist end? Thankfully. Just hang out. It's been a long time coming. Thanks for making it happen. That special spark you have inside that you used to help us. You're gonna help a lot of people win that spark. Aww. Hey, baby, that's the spark can one day light a fuse. Oh no. And the fuse burns all the way up to the to a boomstick. And then boom. <laughs> Explosion. Explosion indeed. Oh well, we'll just have to see what happens, I guess. A rat can dream. Take care, little scout. Don't be a stranger. Wouldn't dare, Swampy Swoo. <laughs> Swampy Swooty, you too, Liz. Can, can I speak with you, please? Ah, oh, the bunny. Hello? Oh, she's still sleeping. Anybody in there? Still sleeping. Poor man must be tuckered out from all the excitement. Sleep tight, little one. So that means there's probably more people hanging out somewhere. Because we haven't found Daisy. 
right? I can't speak with you two for some reason. For some reason. No drop, and then... I haven't seen... Yeah, I haven't seen Daisy and the kid that likes the rocks, right? That went great. Oh, hey, and tough. Okay. Nope. Hi, tough. Ah, it's Rickus. My favorite spot. What you doing all the way out here? Just taking a breather. Not one for parties? Not usually, no. It's mostly the noise. My ears are a bit sensitive. It doesn't take much before it's too much. Ah, uh, well, I'm glad you came either way. There's no wrong way to party. I'm glad you think so. Hey, do you mind if I ask you an honest question? Sure. The mushroom on your head. Were you born with it? Can you feel through it? And if so, what do you feel? I've been wondering this whole time. I have a lot of follow-up questions after these ones. It's not. It's not what? Can you feel through it? Can you not feel through it? Or... Only when you're older. Or heaven forbid. Did you have an accident? Toph, it's a hat. Just a mushroom hat. Oh, that makes sense then. Well, you sure picked a good one. It's quite pretty. Don't need a little bit poisonous. If you had to eat it to survive, you could. You could, but you wouldn't enjoy it. Um, good to know. Thanks, Toph. No thanks. No, thanks. You for coming to check in on me. Good luck on your next adventure. The same to you. Okay. We're we're missing people. Where's supposed to be here? Okay. I think Haley is supposed to be giving us a silent message to not talk to her. Yeah, that's Snowdrop. The one who's fascinated with stars. Fascinated by rocks. And then there's the mother. And with Anne here. Annie. Anne. Sure, no going back. Talk to me when you're ready, ready. What? Yeah. I... Okay. I'm ready to go now. Sure thing. You feeling better? Yes. Yep, yeah, thanks for listening to me. Not a problem, kid. We all need a little support sometimes. I'm still a little scared to tell Mel HQ. Mail Scout HQ. But it'll be okay. 
Yes, you'll be fine. They know deliveries don't always go as planned. We can just come back when Greg's out of hibernation and try it again. And then I'll be more prepared. Exactly. You did 55 deliveries today from what I hear. It wasn't always easy. But I'm so happy I was able to help everyone today. Sadly, because of the Greg business, the higher-ups won't be able to give you your official Mail Scout patch yet. But don't you worry, kid. Unofficial Mail Scout patch? Oh, that's cute. Woo! I got you one right here. Ah! Damn it! You stole from work? I'm calling the CEO of Mail right now. No, no, no. I made you one. Because you're a true Mail Scout to me. Regulus, are you gonna say anything? Janet, you're the best mom a boss could wish for? No, wait. You're the best boss a scout could mom put. No. You know, what I, you know what? It doesn't matter. I don't have to be perfect. Thank you, mom boss Janet. You're not my kid. You know what? Never mind. Let it out, scout. Say what you need to say. I am unofficial male scout, baby. <laughs> That's so cute. Oh, was that the end of it? That was so cute. I didn't want it to be over yet, though. that coin. These pictures are just so cute. This game was a lot of fun. I would definitely recommend this one to anyone. It's, it's very adorable. <laughs> very adorable and very, very calm and laid back actually. There wasn't really any rush to any of it. It was all very Very cute. Stop or else. <laughs> it's a very, very adorable game. Very laid back. Fun. Oh, he got a fossil. with his little hat. So cute. Off with her mushrooms. That's cute.
and they're having a lot of fun. Probably on a beach. That's cute though. <laughs> Judgmental mushroom. That's adorable. And ham eating all of his blueberries and cheese. Well, that was meal time. Uh, it, I don't know what else to say about it. It's amazing. Um, it, it's an adorable little game. It's very laid back, and it's just 
it's very much worth the little bit of money that it it they put it as because it just very much worth it 100 percent do not recommend enough sit there and play with the the outfits and the the hats and all that stuff it's so adorable anyway thank you all so much for joining me on this adorable and amazing adventure uh do please leave a like leave any thoughts and you know anything like that in the comment section section down below do please let me know or see what uh outfits that y'all chose and what uh mushroom hats were your favorite and uh do please subscribe and i will see y'all in the next one thank y'all bye bye